welcome back gang for the first time and hopefully many more to come don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and click on the notifications right here this little bell so you can get those emails every time we go live peace uh, the Ortiz just to, um, news program. And, uh, Is this fight have to happen for the legacy of the I want to thank Steve this point for the uh, uh, if, it, if it happened, it happened. But, I mean, I want the fight to happen. It's too bad. I want to thank Steve at Showtime and it has to happen. I mean, understanding uh, uh, what, you know, especially how what he's, he's talking through. about. Yeah. And for their continued loyalty and their continued support. Um, of Deontay's career. My last question. Um, you know, I was so excited as was Deontay when we had a press conference at that top of that hotel. Yeah, because before so that, that we were a fight that, that all, guys, all you guys were so excited about against the guy that nobody wants to fight. It was kind of hard, but I mean, against the guy that Deontay insisted on fighting. And then somehow, yet again, for the third time, I got to take this. In a year and a half, no fault of. Uh, uh, this young man to my right, who's a great champion, um, the I fight went away. Fight. I mean, and I we didn't create a lot of people to come the vibe of the fight. They got so I'm doing a lot of to the uh, field of being a top ten. Myself, oh, that's great. A group great of people. To we didn't overdo. Family uh, tests. I was definitely overdue. We didn't walk away from any fight. In fact, he was going to sacrifice money, money on the table. I haven't been getting it. In order to fight why they a fight these guys that would be a defining moment. You know, he was willing to go to Russia to fight a fight tonight. that was supposed to be a defining so moment. Be my breakout year. And that cheater. EJ, he's a very philosophical talker. In, in, but in the Russia, bottom line is, do you want that green belt again, by the end of 2018? That green belt's a nice looking um, belt. And then even I mean, coming the back from, from to, you know, two I mean, major injuries, crown jewel. one fight, yeah, the crown jewel. surgery, and coming want back, to and something that uh, the opponent now you got a, a very tough for opponent for your next fight. fight. Yeah. Did they give you we opponents that were lighter really opponents or not up to Peterson's level uh, that you rejected? Because I know you were adamant about and getting a top notch fighter. Uh, uh, I mean, they already know. I don't want to fight anybody. I don't want to fight any bombs. or not bombs, but yeah, I know. Six class fighters or guys that's not the top five level. I want to fight the best. Guys. Fight you would That's what I get up for. If the fight was I, want fight, I want to put the best fight. I want to have these guys you know, on, on my name. I want to get these guys you know, in my legs. I beat him. I beat him. I beat the the guy. Guy. So, you know, that's what I plan and, on doing. It doesn't uh, change because I won a world title. Now I got to pick and choose who I want to fight. Like, on a personal he's too hard. I, I want to fight the best. Last one to clear the air. If there was no promotional issues or there was no um, long term contracts, if it was just you and Carl, one fight off, would you have taken that fight? Yeah, yeah with, with no other obligations. No other obligations. And great happens, name, you know, man he's been named a lot, he's a legacy, mm -hmm. yeah, you know, he's probably a future Hall of Famer, so and I know that, they probably uh, took that fight with no, with no things attached. Be, be clear, right? Be clear to everybody out there. All right, appreciate your time. Yeah, I, I agree with you 100% on what you said. Got a lot of anger and, and a lot of emotions that came out that night. 25 years ago, a 182 world champion, you signed it, could you sign it for me? There'll be no fighters that the Yonke Wilder. There's a people from Muhammad Ali to Joe Frazier. That's a sensational night of boxing. It's on Showtime uh, because of, of the efforts right of Stephen and, mm -hmm. and Stephen, like I said, is one yep, of the book of uh, Deontay uh, through the top stretch. It's going to be a great show. Sean Porter is fighting Adrian Granado. The story of London is fighting for the title. The undercard is going to be sensational. But most importantly, the heavyweight championship of the world is going to be contested by America's heavyweight champion, the Andre Wilder. So, Lamont Peterson is known as a pressure fighter, yeah. you know, as of late, but when he fought Danny Garcia, a pressure fighter with a power punch, he seemed to move a lot. Yeah. You know, are you prepared for that? I'm prepared for it. Man, I've seen it all through my amateur background. I've seen it all, so, I mean, it doesn't matter. What it is. Yeah. 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 Yeah.